Hey you guys and welcome back to my channel. So today I've got something special, don't I always? Uh, my best friend is starting his own makeup line and he got his samples in and he brought them to me so that I could play with them on film and show y'all what is coming and what should be up for pre-order hopefully right now, if not right now, very soon. So today I played in his makeup palette. It looks like this. And it will have a logo right in here when it's officially out. <clears throat> and when you open it up, it's got a huge mirror and it is very loved. But these are the colors that are in it. It has got a nice arrangement, some super pretty colors, and it is super pigmented. So today I created this look with this palette. It is very bright. It is very amazing. You can also do a lot of neutral looks with this, but... If you knew him the way I know him, I decided that a colorful look would be the best one to represent what this palette is really like. So this is cruelty free. It is awesome quality so far. So good. I'm going to give y'all a tutorial and then I'm going to give y'all my final thoughts after all is said and done. But if you want to see how to create this look, keep watching. And if you think you want to pre-order it, hit the description right down there and I'll have the link to his website and I'll also go ahead and put the link to his YouTube channel where there will be a video of us doing a get ready with me some behind the scenes stuff and some awesome videos of him as well so I'm gonna go ahead and get y'all into your tutorial here y'all go okay y'all so first things first I gotta grab this real good transition shade right here and yes I still have ratchet nails judge me all you want and I'm just gonna go into that on the crease just to set this look up and this pigment is good fallout is about medium nothing too crazy okay so that was just our transition so then we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna go in with this peachy shade right here and put that in the crease too just to kind of deepen it up a little bit oh and this one is pigmented you guys so we're just going to deepen this up trying to blend softly so the color doesn't accidentally explode and just deepen it up through here Okay, and we are doing all of this with a Morphe 518, if y'all are curious. And after that, we are going to go into this pink shade right here. It's a little bit burgundy-ish, just a little darker, but not too dark. And we're going to put that in the crease too to add a pop of color. Okay, so after this, we're going to go ahead and deepen this up even more, and we're going to go into this darker red right here, and focus that in the outer edge of that crease just to get us a little more dimension. Okay, and just for that final pop in the outer corner, we're going to go into this brown shade right here. And we are going to put that in the very, very outer corner of my eye to make this smoke out real good. Okay. So that is it for the crease. We are going to go in because I have been dying to play with this shade ever since I saw the palette with this orange right here. And we're going to put that all over the lid because I am living for this color. And I was right. This is so pretty, y'all. Okay. Okay, guys. So now is the time when I sneak off camera and I finish up my liner, mascara, and lashes. And I will be right back. 
<laughs> okay guys so I'm back I went ahead and added a little bit to my lower lash line just some of that pink color kind of tie it together and blended it out with a little bit of that tan did some liner and some lashes which you know I messed my liner up but it ain't my video if my liner ain't messed up so that's okay and I added a lippy I used a crank phones lippy because he hasn't come out with lippies just yet but they will be coming eventually and I think I am loving this look. So for my final opinions, um, <clears throat> first off, this color selection is definitely nice. You have your neutrals, some kind of purpley colors, pinks, you got a gold and an orange. This is our duochrome, and then you have your darker ones down here that are kind of burnt looking too. And I actually forgot I'm going to take this duochrome and just put it right here because it is really pretty and it reflects like super super nice like I really like it I'm gonna put a little bit right there and that just has a nice reflect in it and it's kind of shiny gives you a nice little something to tie the rest of the look together so overall like I'm really digging this palette hopefully right now it's already up for pre-order which is incredible uh, you should be able to go to the website and get it. I'll leave the website down in the description. It should just be bsbcosmetics.com. This is a brand new startup, so it's the only thing that's going to be available right now. But this is a great palette. I'm so excited to be the first person to get my hands on it. And it is indeed, by the way, cruelty free, which is amazing. But that is it for my review of this palette. This is my look. I absolutely love it and I love this bright look and I cannot wait to go show it off right now. But that is it for today's video. That is it for my review. I hope you guys consider trying this palette out. Help my friend out. This is a new startup and I love to see new companies starting out and I love to help them kind of advance where they're going and I love to share my opinions on the products and really he's like my best friend in the world and we are so honest with each other if this was terrible i would tell you i'm just saying he knows but uh that's it i will see you guys in my next video bye